to the love of my life on our wedding day. I can't believe today is the day. As we were preparing, I can't help but look back on all our hopes for the future with the last five years. The details have changed, but the big picture remains the same, building a life together that we love. I'm so excited to begin this journey as husband and wife, and I can't wait to see you. I love you endlessly. Corey. I think it's normal for most people to have cold feet before they get married. I feel that is completely understandable as marriage is a life-altering commitment. However, this is a feeling I will never get to experience. As I am writing this letter, rather than being scared of what the future holds or what could have been without you, I am sitting here completely content with how my life has played out. You are the love of my life. I take you to be my wife, to be faithful to you alone. Luke, I take you to be my husband, to share all that is to come. Encompassing all sorrow and joys, all hardships and triumphs. I make a permanent commitment to you, Made in love. I make a permanent commitment to you, kept in faith, and continually made new. And the power vested in me by the state of Indiana, I now confirm this covenant of holy marriage and declare you to be husband and wife, united in the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. And what God has now joined together, let no one separate. Therefore, you are no longer two, but one in God's sight. Luke, you may kiss your bride. Growing up with you has been one of my greatest blessings and has given me my best memories. I have uh, looked up to Luke my whole life. You've been a great role model and an even better brother. And I thank you for spending countless hours with me playing basketball, and tell me what I can and can't get away with. Um, Corey, you get my brother better than anyone. <laughs> you're kind, you're smart, and you have a great sense of humor. And I'm glad to call you my sister. I've seen these two support each other when things were really tough through a couple of knee surgeries, through deaths in the family, through sicknesses, and they continually love each other really, really well. On behalf of Ange and I, we couldn't be happier to have you in our family, Luke. We, I love you like a son, and uh, we are just thrilled uh, to have you. I do have to say, little Luke, just how lucky you are. You leave here today with a wife who's warm, loving, and caring. And Corey, how lucky you are as well. You'll leave here today with the best brother-in-law you could have ever asked for. 
So I know Corey's studying finance, so I thought it would be appropriate to end with a statistic. So for this one, I would like Corey and Luke to face one another. You are now looking into the eyes of the person who is statistically most likely to murder you. So don't be a statistic. 